Hi, this is Anne. I am one of the cataloging librarians for the Technical Services Department at your Baltimore County Public Library. Did you ever wonder if working for a museum or archives or library or any place of historical interest might suit your personality? If you like organizing things, a little bit of research, or just helping people in general, then cataloging or archives work might be a good fit for you. Uh, also, if you have an interest in coding, that definitely helps. In a nutshell, my job as a cataloger in technical services is to make it as easy as possible for you to find whatever it is that you're looking for from BCPL. Everything that goes into our library catalog is filed under a record. How well that record is created can make all the difference between you actually finding what you're looking for or missing it entirely, which if that's ever happened to you, you know how frustrating that can be. So I'm sharing this little snapshot of what I do because it relates to some of the volunteer opportunities that I've found online where you can help make records more searchable as a digital volunteer. The first one is from the U.S. National Archives. Uh, U.S. National Archives has a collection of missions already organized by subject where you can just jump right in and help transcribe or tag a variety of different documents. For example, one of their missions is a collection of nearly 100 years worth of photographs from the Bureau of Public Roads, where you help identify what's in the photographs, different vehicles, objects, landmarks, and locations. But one of the nice things about being a digital volunteer for the National Archives is that you are not limited to these curated collections on their missions page. You're welcome to explore the entire catalog and tag anything that you find of interest. They can be all different kinds of documents, letters, pictures. They even have movie clips where you listen to them or watch them and you tag what you hear, uh, different subjects of what they're talking about, or you just transcribe the clip, which is pretty cool. Next up, I have Library of Congress. Library of Congress began crowdsourcing their digital volunteer projects very recently, just a couple years ago. Their projects are called By the People and they're organized by campaigns. One of these campaigns is to actually transcribe a collection of letters to Lincoln that they have that spans from 1865 to 1889. And you can definitely also check out their other current campaigns, some that include the work of groundbreaking civil rights activists and suffragists. So National Archives and Library of Congress, those are some very history heavy projects. And if that's for you, I encourage you to check those out. There's another diverse collection of other digital initiatives taking place on the Zooniverse that you can also check out. The Zooniverse is a directory of reviewed projects who need volunteers to collect data or transcribe information. Currently, there are about 100 projects to browse through and they span all disciplines, not just history. One of the projects I found is this one on river herring where you just watch these short clips of these river herring fish swim by and you count as many as you can all the different fish. And what this information does, it helps researchers um, track the spawning behavior of these near endangered fish. Another one I found is on burrowing animals where again, you just watch these video clips of these owl families and you observe and document their behavior. Anything that you see in the video clips, um, how that affects these family groups of owls. So if you like animals, uh, birds, bugs, the Zooniverse is definitely a place to check out. And all these projects help researchers collect information they need to make efforts on animal conservation. So that's pretty cool. All right, so these are just a few places to explore if you think that research or transcription work or down the line, maybe cataloging work might be a good fit for you. I hope that you find something interesting and enjoyable. Thank you for joining me.